I want to wish you all a happy Christmas and I hope that you've all had a very good few days and I hope that you spent it with your loved ones because you never do know what's around the corner. Now, um, I had um, a comment, well, a request um, to get offer some advice to uh, somebody who likes to watch my videos um, and he wants me to sort of offer him some advice basically he's found himself in a little dilemma um so this is what that video is about um i'm going to read you sort of a shortened version um of of what it is that he want he wants to work uh, to know so basically he wants to know how to conduct a relationship between a working girl and a regular customer he says that he's found himself in this um dilemma a couple of times um with a couple of girls um he, he mentioned that they do he, uh, the girls that he actually is, that he sees, um, he he does actually get them from the red light district, um. So he's, he says he, he wonders if, if if this may be the reason to his dilemma, which I'm going to come on telling you in a second. Um, he says it all starts out fine, you know. Obviously, um, you know, business business as usual, um, you know, paying paying for sex and going basically, um, and then he says it kind of progresses over time. Like it obviously becomes a regular. Um, then it's, he says it feels more like a friends with benefits type, type um, scenario. Um, and he says, and then they, it even goes as far as um, when he takes them shopping um, and helps them out, so to speak, um, that they even hold hands. And um, the girl, the girl who was the girls who are speaking about, um, have also gave him sort of uh, personal information like the, their real name. Um, he, they've even added him on Facebook as a friend, um, and they then go on to say that um it doesn't feel like a customer anymore they really like him um and tell him how handsome he is they also say that he's got a big cock um obviously i would imagine that he you know she's saying how good he is in bed and obviously it doesn't feel like a customer anymore um she also the, the girls that he's talking about are also saying that they love him um he's saying but it's more said um before she then requests something financially um, but whenever they do sort of have sex, it's still, she still wants money and she still wants it before it starts. So basically what is, what he wants to know as well is if working girls sort of say anything to, to you know, to make guys, customers believe that they are, that's, you know, that they're boyfriend and girlfriend really, and possibly going to turn into more than what it started. So my advice or my my answer to this is it's always always going to be a business relationship from from the girl's point of view it's never going to be anything else um i mean i hope i don't offend anybody um because of obviously you've got to be careful when you offer an advice but i guess that's why it's come to me because i fucking just say how it is i mean the, the girl is obviously just playing him um and it's not you know it's not very nice to know but but that's what it is i mean i i'd also i'd like to say that at the time when he started sort of um having a little uh, switching up in his mind that he kind of likes this girl she would have picked up on that you didn't even need you don't need to say it you don't need to say the words and if you look on if you made it if you broke your if you broke this down into a timeline um i can more or less bet money on it that more or less a few days later she would then start to go on to say how, she, how much she likes you know she, she likes you and everything um my advice is that there is absolutely no way to conduct a relationship with a working girl other than work um the best thing you could do is test her um and how i would go about that if i was you i would sort of not give any, given any financial help whatsoever no matter how many dilemmas this girl then goes on to have because believe me she'll have two or three a day people will be dying in her family her electric will be off she'll be sat freezing she's got no food um probably she's already used them i, I, I don't know they're sort of classic examples of a uh, quick fix short little money that, that that girls that girls say to people to, to get money out of them or, or, or anybody to get money out of them really if, if it's a blag um so I do. I put her off financially for a week. Still contact her. Still, you know, still speak. You will notice that she, once she realizes that you're not, she's not getting anywhere with with these dilemmas. That 
she probably will not see you as much she won't be as talkative there won't be as many texts per day as there is um that sort of thing really um and that's how you will tell really um whether she is sort of genuine with you or not i guess um i hope this kind of helps you and answers your question um and i look forward to your response to my video